the 100 euro household charge is, as Enda Kenny himself said, a morally an unjust tax. He was right, unfortunately, he changed his mind, but I haven't. I do think it's wrong. We bought our homes at the height of the Celtic Tiger, most of us did who are relatively young, and we paid our fortune in stamp duty, but that was it as far as I was concerned. That was our tax, it was paid. Now, on the other hand, I know our country is banjaxed, and I'm not saying that we shouldn't help. Of course we ought to help, and the 100 euro doesn't seem like much to those who have jobs. And yeah, you know, I'd give it to my local authority and then I could see where my 100 euro is going. But it, it won't go there. It'll go into the black hole of our debt. And I do think that that is totally unfair. And especially the property tax. If people can barely pay 100 euro this year, what on earth are they going to do next year? We have couples and families are breaking point. Nobody knows what bill is going to come in the door next. People are struggling to put food on the table. And, you know, people are also taking their own lives. And I think it is unbelievably sad the way Ireland has ended up. You know, I mean, the Celtic tiger is dead. And quite frankly, good riddance. You see, we were never, ever a nation of tigers. We are a nation of warriors, saints and scholars. You know, yes, our hearts are broken, but our spirits are not broken. And it is our Celtic spirit that will roar far louder than any Celtic tiger ever did. Yeah, My message, to be quite honest, is very simple. Our day will come. Thank you. Thank you.